<gasps> Your chicken? Is this the Icon Meals? No. Yes. It's the frozen oh, Mexican chicken. chicken. Check this. That's gonna get a spanking. No, you're going to get spanked. <laughs> I like how the light's behind me. It looks like I'm like... Saint. Majestic. Yeah. We haven't even done the intro. This is the intro. Do you want to do it? Hi everybody, welcome back to another video on... The Electrics. Was my ass necessary? I'm sorry, my butt. Was that necessary in the last why. video? I don't know why. I put that in there and I didn't. I Did didn't. Did you forget to take it out? No, I put that in there. Intentionally? Like, because people like. Skip over? Skip over stuff. And like a handful of people got it. So now, shout out to the handful of people that got that. Now you need to go back and watch it if you didn't see Eric's butt. Yeah, last video, everybody. Uh, check it out. Okay, so welcome back to another video on I The Electrics. Oh, I was like, I I'm officially doing it. Um, Why wasn't mine official? Okay. Do you want? Do you want to get a spanking? <laughs> Can we just take a moment <laughs> to admire how beautiful Christy looks tonight in her new fresh new new merch? Did you get me some merch? I got a honey, but I don't know if you want it. What size? It's a small, but it's I think it'll fit you. Um, is that is that a joke? A small? Have you seen these? Geese? Here, I'll get it. You can try it on. This is like banana yellow. It's neon green or neon yellow. It's neon. I can tell you right now, I do not fit into smalls. Oh, look, it looks like it's fitting you. This is a small? Yep. Yeah, it ain't, that ain't happening. It's gonna shrink up too. Mm. I'll get you a bigger size. I look like I'm like. You look so. You look like a highlighter. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna put a little. Picture of a highlighter <laughs> right there. Um, all right, guys, well, welcome back to another video. Um, in this video today, we have actually some stuff on the table that is probably random, but the highlight of today's video is the fact that we are doing Krispy Kreme. I'm not doing Krispy Kreme. We are eating the Krispy Kreme Reese's Donuts. Now, these have graced Krispy Kreme's menu recently. And a lot of people have been tagging us. Um, actually, just me, because I don't think people tag you for the Reese's. No. Um, they tag me in the ketchup stuff. Understandably so, um, or rightfully so. And uh, so Krispy, came, Krispy Kreme has not, these aren't all new donuts. A lot of people think they're new, but we've, um, we've, we've had, so we did the Reese's filled donut in a video. That one? This this one right oh. here. So they have the Reese's filled donut and then they have the Reese's top donut with filling inside of it. Um, this is more of like a, it's just one of like the, like kind of like a cake batter donut, but they just make sure it's like Reese's filling instead and hmm. put Reese's chips on top. And then they have the Reese's outrageous donuts. And so we were also out recently at the store and we Street saw tacos. we saw some Lay's potato chips. Now, I don't know, I'm thinking that the, New York style pizza one is gonna be better. Actually, you know what? No. No, I don't which, know. Which well, one do those you think? are gonna taste like Pringles, I bet. Okay. Um, um, I bet this is gonna be like lime and Carnitas, cilantro. so this is Carnita Street Taco Lace. So Carnita Street Taco Lace, and then New York style pizza lace. So we got those, and the whole point of t tonight's video, everybody, is that we are going to review these so that we can let you guys know if it's worth buying or not. Of course. I got some tortillas because I've been eating a lot of tacos lately. You have fish in your hair. Got it. Just like I'm gonna eat your taco later. Baby. My sister actually. Oh uh, no. Shout out to. <laughs> what do you mean? Oh no. How do you think I feel when you mention your mom watching my video or watching our videos? Does your sister actually watch these? She. So the last one, I guess, was a little too over the top for her. Which which part? Um. Like seeing your butt. Shout, shout out to you, Morgan. No, that was. More, oh, my sister see my butt a lot, okay? I used to walk around the house nude as a kid. So what was so over the top for her? I, the, uh, we made a lot of, definitely, a few jokes. I can't remember. <laughs> you really can't I remember? I remember I did say I thought it was over the top though. I agreed with you and Eric said, we don't wear stuff and I said, well, yeah, I Yeah, so. la last, last, last video was, Everyone's gonna just stop watching the video and go watch last week's video, which you guys can do. Just make sure you come back to this one. Um, and I went lazy this this evening. I usually make my own pico de gallo, but I bought this store bought. It's kind of nice, like it's not. It's filth. filth. 
It's both. It looks like there's a lot of onions in there. And Christy's not eating onions because it's it's FODMAP. It is. It's FODMAP. It makes her it makes her tummy. Don't. Okay, well if you experience bloat, let's have this conversation. If you have a lot of You're bloat- You're talking to me about bloat? Okay, well if you cut out your onions, maybe your bloat would go away. If you cut out your garlic, your bloat would go away. Just saying. Just saying. Remember when you listened to me about the celery? That wasn't you. That was somebody else. I said it, but I guess you heard it from somebody else. He was eating like a pound of celery. Way more than a pound, like an and, entire large stock. And he stock. was always complaining about being so bloated. And I was like, Eric, you're eating way too many veggies. No, I'm not. You don't know what you're talking about. Is, so that, how, hear it. is that how I said it? Yep. Great impression. So I guess you had to hear it from somebody else. So. My Hard day? No, my reminders. I set reminders on my phone throughout the day. You do? Every day, recurring ones, yep. What kind of reminders? The first one is, um, the first one rolls in at like mid afternoon and it reminds me to take my thyroid meds and iced coffee <laughs> just to keep me focused. You need the a afternoon. reminder? Yeah, because I always forget. I like, I lose track of time. So that, that rolls in at three. Then I have one that rolls in at four that says to stretch. That's a good, that's, a, that's a valid stretch. reminder to have. And then the next one that rolls in reminds me to take, um, to do my fiber lice drink at night. And then, oh no, there's one before that that says, um, stay focused, it's supposed to be uncomfortable, which is just a reminder to not get in your cereal. And then, that's usually <laughs> what I tell myself when I'm trying to poop in the morning. Oh. Yeah, after okay. challenges, can you can you imagine how uncomfortable it is sometimes? I can hear how uncomfortable it is sometimes. Really? Sometimes. I'm actually kind of impressed with myself. You can hear it. <laughs> what do you mean? I'm or not... like hear me like? <laughs> I I no. I have a very actually we're just not gonna go there. Okay, let's yeah let's. Um, <laughs> I get a lot of questions about that already, and I just don't. I don't usually. Address. Usually, you usually go when I leave in the morning, though. No, I mean I. I'm very. I'm typically. I'm not. I'm here. fine with pooping around you, at this point. Well, I am too, but I'm just saying that typically I'm gone, so I don't hear anything. Or anyway, anyway. Anyways. Move on. Um. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Although I, I do have to say that I feel like. No matter how uncomfortable those conversations get, it's so human, but for some reason, it doesn't matter how old you get, it's still like a taboo topic yeah. that nobody wants to talk it's about. It's definitely, I definitely, especially a taboo in new topic. relationships. Like, I don't like, I don't Well, know. if it's a new relationship, for sure. Especially in that and farting. <laughs> That's I remember true. we had that. I, I don't fart around you ever. Yeah, you are you burp for sure. Burp is um, burping. I feel like it's see. I I'm, I'm we we agree with that. If you guys agree with us, I I, I think that farting around your significant other is de well, at least like in a new relationship. Uh, that yeah. sends a, st a strong message, like way more than it's like a way burp. too comfortable. Oh, totally. Absolutely. You're like <laughs> you're however you do a little girl girl burps. I'm like oh, that's cute. If you like fart, I'd be like. <laughs> So, uh, so I think we should we should start things off with the chips. Here's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna try one of the flavors of chips, and then we're gonna move towards the donuts. Um, and like I said, hold on really quick, babe. I gotta preface this. Um, the Reese's donuts, I have had them before. I have had th this one. I had in 2017. So it's been three years. Holy crap, time flies. I had that one in 2018 when I was when we had, we had three weeks after we met. And I was staying, was staying at your sister. It's funny and, how he remembers. Um, yeah, I remember that. I have a, a selfie photo of me going in front of like a dozen of them. And then this one I had, I don't remember when I had it, but I know I've eaten it before. Okay. So um, the thing is, is I'm not really sure if they're gonna still taste as good. So we'll see. Well, so, I actually don't really remember liking that one too much. Um, we actually, we did eat that a few months ago. I've never been impressed with Krispy Kreme's chocolate donuts. Yeah. So, so we're going to, at the at, at like the food. at the end of it all, we're going to give you guys our opinion and let you know whether it's worth it or not, especially with these chips. So let's try these chips. So this is the Carnita Street Taco Chips. Chips? Chip? Just going to... That 
That is odd. Very odd. What do you think that tastes like? Not a taco. I am trying to pinpoint what exactly. It's like stuck in my teeth. There's not much flavor to it, to be honest. Yeah, there's not at all. Don't get these guys. Yeah, like I'm like I, I, I'm like lost. Hey, kind of has like a, an herby there's taste. There's a Carnia Street Taco seasoning on it. Garlic powder. Medium chain triglycerides. You're gonna get your gains in here, guys. Yeah. Um, Just kidding. Yeah, definitely not. Um, Bacon fat. So these are not vegan. <laughs> um, those I'm gonna say I definitely would not buy again. They would probably be really good dipped in, like maybe not eaten solo. Like if you were to dip them in bean dip or no. That was one of my. I don't get good images in my mind when I think about bean dip. Like the kind that your mom always has when we go over there? Yeah, like eating oh. that, I'm like... So good. I could take a bag of chips and a can of those and just pound it. Oh, so good. Did you ever eat those as a kid? I was thinking about making a joke there, but I won't. Um, I, I ate normal things as a child. That was normal. Actually, I didn't. I ate pancakes covered in chocolate chocolate and chocolate chips and peanut butter with... with Marshmallows, candy. Yeah, basically like that that scene from the Elf. Yeah, I was just gonna that say That was basically elf. My, my childhood. That's funny. Um, let's let's wait on those. Let's do. Um, we're gonna break up the, gonna go the sweet sweetness. And salty. Okay. Um, with these. Okay, so this is the Reese's filled donut. Now I just want to say right now that they kind of uh, failed on the presentation. A little bit. Okay. All right. Cheers. I'm definitely getting peanut butter and chocolate in that. Yeah. Um, it's definitely not bad. But there's like no filling in it though. Uh huh. Okay, so well, that's Christy's donut. Definitely has filling. So take a bite out of mine. And this is my donut. <laughs> there's there's subpar filling in my donut. Eric did not get filling. Don't take a bite out of that. That's the thing. Well, I mean, when you mass produce mass produce donuts like this, I mean, they're not going to always be not the most be consistent. Perfect, yeah. Yeah. See. Like that side. It's not. Ow! It just bit my lip. Ow! It has to be. Um. It has to be even. Like. Maybe it was a new employee on the donut fill line. I was. Yeah. I remember going there when I was filming um, my 10,000 calorie eat and burn challenge, and I was. Which so... was fantastic, by the way. If you guys have oh, not thanks. gone and seen that video, it's probably the best video he's ever done. I appreciate that. It, it is though. Like it's. I wasn't, I like typically <laughs> watching. If she does watch the video, she's like. I'm like on my phone and I'm up and I'm up, you know, but I was like, I I was like totally engaged with it. It was so good. I appreciate that. So you guys can go I went it. through. Um, Hell. Pretty much. I felt really bad because the day he was filming that, I was in Washington partying at a wedding. Yeah, I think you were probably. He was going through. <laughs> yeah, he was burning really 10,000 calories. Yeah. Um, well, yeah. Ooh. So they did, so at the wedding, they, cause we haven't, we haven't done a mukbang since I came back, did we? Have we? Um, I don't, I don't think so. Um, at the wedding, they had two signature drinks and one was a strawberry margarita and one was a, um, it was a mule, but it wasn't a Moscow mule. It was like a bourbon mule. And I was like, ugh, gross. Um, but it was an open bar. And so the bartender was like, I'll make it with whatever you want. And I was like, well, what's best with a Moscow mule? Cause typically it's vodka. Mm -hmm. And he's like, have you ever tried it with gin? And I was like, no, I haven't. He's like, you're going to like it with gin. It was so good. I had like probably. Five, How many? Five or six. Really? Yeah. How big? Um, how big were those drinks? Oh, I mean like not like maybe like a shot. Worth. Oh, okay. Um, I mean, that's crazy. Dope. Like me and Sarah, we were going to town. We were like, putting it back. Yeah, um, it was really fun. And Marisol, just friends of mine, she's like all prim and proper with her wine. I was like, give me the gin. <laughs> yeah, I would have much rather have been there than here. I didn't. I didn't finish filming like fully until I think like two in the morning. Which is funny because I was in my hotel room asleep by. 10, 11. Yeah, I like, <laughs> I got done and I was like, I wonder what Christy's doing right now. Christy and then I legitimately just wanted to go to sleep. Yeah. Like I, I did not like, 
when I got done out in in the garage on the bike, I legit just I was like, cool. I had some in and out today and some donuts and some Skittles and Powerade. Like I'm cool. I'll just go to sleep. But I like. <sighs> I was thinking as I was filming the last part, I was like, dude, like this is legit, not just like crazy, the craziest physical thing I've ever done, but like craziest thing I've actually ever mm -hmm. done for my channel. Mm. Um, it's one of those things where like, it's not gonna be as like, well, people aren't, it's not gonna get like a ton of views like a crazy food challenge would, but um, it's more important for me to like, Start and, bringing a side of you that most Yeah, this year see. has definitely been a lot different and I think people are really starting to see a difference if they haven't caught on already like I'm not just focusing on eating crazy amounts of food every week now it's like I'll still do that but I think it's really important to like tell a better show a, like a more personal side to you totally. and like tell like it create um, something rather than just you know a dude eating a ton of food yeah totally we were talking about because I know you guys really want me to do like a 5K. Someone I really wants to do. I really do look like, what is that Catholic saint with the halo? I don't know, I don't. It's not Mary, or maybe, is it Mary? It's got the halo. I don't know. I don't know, with the light. Mother Teresa? No, she don't know. No, never mind. I look like I should be in stained glass though. With that light. Um, will you put a picture right there? Okay, thanks. Um, <laughs> I know a lot of you guys want to see me do a 5,000 calorie one. So after seeing him do the 10,000 calorie spurt, my active. Oh, you like a 5,000 calorie eat? Yeah, like a 5,000 calorie eat and a 5,000 calorie burn. Cause like on a really good day for me, as far as like activity goes, I actively burn 700 calories. That's it. Like that's, I'm like really happy if I hit 700 calories. So and what's I, the most calories you've ever burned in one day? I don't know. I'm. I, I mean, like, I'm so new to using this, so I, I have no idea. But like, try to guess after like your run, mm -hmm. your relay, oh. big relay that you did. You're running like the, eight the, miles con at a time. the concept of calories back then. I didn't understand. Oh. I didn't know. I didn't. I just ran and I ate. Like I didn't have. I mean, those this, were those were the good old days. If this video gets five thousand likes, <laughs> it's not gonna get. Would you? Oh, yeah, would, would, you would you? Would you try? Would you try for a five? A five thousand. What, what would I have to do? So I'm thinking you probably. I'm not probably, running a half marathon. I'm not doing. You that. probably have to. Well, you probably have to walk a lot if you're not going to be willing to run. You probably have to like. Walking isn't that bad. No. Like, I mean, I walk for I walk for like five or six hours, um, like once a week, and that burns roughly like twenty three to twenty six hundred calories. But that's for that's for my builds and everything. So that's I'd have to rate. do that on top of like running, or. You probably be your feet would take a huge beating if you did that. Um, but uh, but yeah, I have, if you guys want to see that, five thousand likes. It, well, it could, it could just be an attempt. No, you got to If someone says they can eat five thousand calories, like doesn't you mean say, you can't burn it. Oh well, I mean, yeah, I mean that would be insane. We'll have to, we'll have to, we'll have to explore that. I'd help you if you want. Well, I'm not gonna do it alone. We could try it. We could try it together. Like as a like, I mean, I, I I probably wouldn't ride my bike. I'd probably do like this the walk with like, you and yeah, like we'd have to do it together because there's you'd have to drag me, you'd have to be my David Goggins. <laughs> well, if we get there, we get there. All right, let's do this one. Okay. Um, so this is this one. I I'm actually, actually kind of excited for. So this one. one, it has peanut butter chips on top, and then it's got that Reese's filling on the inside. I actually I made a dedicated video towards this video or towards this donut in 2017. Um, that looks okay. pretty pathetic. Yeah. <clears throat> I'll show you guys. Sneak peek. Just a second. This one's better than the last one. Yeah, this one is really good. So that's the inside of Christie's. It's the inside of mine. They definitely had to put the peanut butter chips on there, or else you oh, would yeah. not get Oh yeah, it totally would not be good if they didn't have the peanut butter chips. The chocolate glaze on that is really good. It's crazy how much like of a taste difference you get from that to that. They're totally different. It's almost like they use different chocolate. Yeah. Um, I, I, interesting. I mean, I'm obviously a huge peanut butter lover. I love Reese's. We know. <laughs> really? You, you know, like. Maybe you got a shirt, you got a mug. Yeah, I got a lot of Reese's stuff. You would have a toilet if you could. <sighs> that'd be cool. Like if Reese's sponsored me, that'd be sick. 
An orange toilet in the lid Just having Reese's on it. <laughs> That'd be sweet. I could do a challenge on it. Crap chocolate. <laughs> Just a theme. <laughs> uh, I definitely, so what would you give for an overall rating on this? So I would say that that's like a four out of 10. Three, you think mm. a three out of 10? So I'm gonna say four out of 10 on that. She's saying three out of 10. Christy's saying three out of 10. For this, I'm gonna give this one an eight point. Actually, I'm gonna give this a nine out of 10. I'm gonna give it a four. What? You said you like that it one. It is good. Here's the problem, okay? Whenever we do, we do these and you rate, and you say something's really good, you give it like a pretty low rating. Because if you're gonna get above a five, it better be like... But dang. I'm not a huge fan of peanut butter. Like I like <laughs> peanut butter, but not, I. if these were fruity donuts, I would much rather eat fruity donuts. See, I'm like the total opposite of No, you. like I'm still thinking about that Homer donut I had for my birthday last year. Was mm -hmm. it last year? No, we didn't go to Universal last year. <coughs> Babe, uh, this will be my second birthday, third. Birthday with you? Yeah. So what did we do last year for my birthday? We went to Universal. No, uh, uh That was the first year we were together. That was 2018. No. What did we do for 2019? No, no, no. That yes, was. Uh -huh. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, Clearly nothing very significant. <laughs> well, I don't think we. I think we just went out to dinner with my mom. That's when we went oh. out to dinner with my mom and Michelle. Right. See, I did remember. Well, this year is gonna be epic. Going to Vegas. Um, okay, so um, let's um, get to the kettle. Oh, these are kettle cooked. I didn't even realize that. New York style pizza. Mm, way better. I always like the pizza from New York. You can't go into it with with it's high expectations. Not... My favorite thing is the salt and vinegar. Thank you. Hold on, I gotta get a decent sized chip. I always like the kettle cooked chips. Me too. Hmm? I said me too. Much better than the other one. Yeah, those are those are way better than those. Those don't even taste like. Those don't taste like anything. Anything like they say they're gonna taste. Yep. Those are super good. I recommend. Those yeah, are like salty. if I was gonna give those a rating, those would be like a negative six. I was gonna say goose egg. These like these are good. I definitely I don't think I'd like. I mean, I just buy, I like Pringles, so I buy pizza Pringles instead of those. Um, I'd give those like a, a four out of 10. Are you doing a dance? Oh, those are tasty. Oh my gosh, she almost <laughs> bit off my finger. Goodness gracious. We've been watching Shark Week. Well, I've been watching Shark Week. I kind of paid attention for like five minutes and I was over it. It's so good, it's on the TV right now. I'll leave you guys here. All right, so I think we should get to our final donut. Okay. This is the Reese's. This no. one's look just like the other one, except it's got pieces. So on. this this is not this is not like this one. This is a I believe this is a cake cake donut, chocolate cake donut with Reese's pieces on top. Was that not a cake and donut? And I'm I'm mistaken. No, that's just oh. a normal like. Oh, okay. Um, so I mistakenly called these the Nutrageous Donuts in my mm. 10,000 calorie burn challenge and Oops. a lot of people didn't like that. So okay. here we go. Oh, these are heavy. Let's do it. It doesn't taste like a cake donut. I was probably wrong on that, but they're good. Yeah, I was, oh. Oh no. Teens will have that. I was definitely wrong on the uh, There's no cake filling. donut. It's not cake donut. The only difference between this one and the first one is there's Reese's Pieces on top. Are they just M&M's? I did not taste any peanut butter it's in Reese's peanut butter. Reese's Pieces. Are you sure? Why would they put M&M's on a, on a Reese's Outrageous Donut? Yeah, you're right. <laughs> By the way, it's a Reese's, Reese's Outrageous Donut. We just put M&M's on it. See, don't spray it. Yeah, those are definitely Reese's Pieces. Um, so here is mm. here's the breakdown. What? It's like Halloween. <gasps> Halloween's coming. Yes, it is. I'm so excited. It's August, but September 1st, whose birthday? Halloween's going up. Christy's the only person that celebrates Halloween and uh, eats um, her uh, uh, her whipped cream or her fat-free whipped cream with uh, coconut coconut yogurt, as everybody else is eating candy. 
That's what you'll be doing on Halloween. Do you remember? So I was going back through like an old album of me and you. The, you know how like iPhone face recognizes and puts a, like you into like albums yeah. and stuff like that. So I was going through one of us and remember the year that you and teens were pizzas and I was a fat pineapple. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yes, I do. I ate so much candy that night. I remember that. That was those were good times. My face was so. Yeah, if you guys want to see a crazy transformation, swan. go to our first video on this channel, the Texas Roadhouse video. That that was a well. That was like the awakening. crazy part is, is like Eye opening. Going like going through the archive of our YouTube videos, you see my Hashimoto's, like the flare ups and how like swollen I got, and like you eating all your restaurant channels with how swollen like you got. Fifteen pounds during <laughs> that trip. Like, it was crazy. <laughs> Um, but, uh, crazy. but yeah, okay, so, Aww, um, so cute. these don't buy these. Mm, those ones are pretty good. Like, they're, I mean, they're decent. I would just stick to regular chips. But. So here's the deal. Reese's filled donuts from Krispy Kreme. I don't think they're worth it. The Reese's peanut butter chips donut. Th those ones look good. Worth it. Yeah. The other ones? I think the Reese's outrageous, definitely worth it. You think so too? I mean, I would get a jelly filled donut, but that's just me. We're not reviewing jelly filled donuts. So I can't recommend it if I wouldn't get it myself. Okay, so you're just an all. Yeah, except for, so I'm just gonna, so you don't recommend this one. I like don't the peanut butter chip one. So I'm just, that's, that's what Christy recommends. So if you guys have tried these, definitely let us know down in the comments below. Let us know if you guys like these review style videos and we'll bring more of them to your eyes. Your glorious eyes as she's looking at me with her glorious eyes. We hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you did, let us know down in the comments below. And we'll bring you guys back with, um, we'll bring you guys back in another video. Can't even and talk. Eric's birthday's coming up, so what do you guys want to see? I'm turning 19. Someone actually thought I was turning 19. I'm like, dude, how did, everyone thinks I look like I'm 40. You drink alcohol. A lot of 19 year olds drink alcohol. Oh, yeah. I can drink alcohol when I was 15. <laughs> Anyways, guys, if you enjoyed the video, let us know. We will see you guys in next week's video. Without further ado, the electrics. We're out.